Want a little land in South Denver? Maybe a small urban farm? Maybe something bigger like a ranchette? I've got you covered. Hey everybody, it's Allison Wall with Live South Denver, your real estate strategist and realtor for the South Denver area. Space from neighbors, for kids, for privacy, for a hot tub maybe with a little peace and quiet possibly for a garden or even horses. It's a popular request that I get from clients. Yet honestly, I can't think of maybe even more than one of those clients who's willing to be in a more remote setting. Everybody wants to be close to town, conveniences, not a long commute to the airport. They want access to neighbors, people, shopping, you know, all the good stuff. So pretty much they wanna have it all. So we're hitting some of the best options right here in South Denver that can give you the best of both worlds. Let's start close to Old Littleton with Mountain Range View. There are about 50 homes in this little enclave neighborhood. They range in size from about 3,000 to 7,000 square feet. Most of the smaller lots run about three quarters of an acre, which is huge in suburban terms, and the larger lots are running over three acres in size. Some of these gorgeous homes actually have barns and pasture areas for horses. These are ag zoned. They actually have a very specific zoning. So you can have equestrian property here and small urban farm, which is why they make the grade for this video. Mountain Range View is a short walk to all the local trail systems, which is fantastic. A very short drive to Old Town Littleton, which hits high on the wish list for a lot of people. They still want a walkable lifestyle. They want to support small business. So it has that going for it. And it is very close to one of the top rated Littleton public school high schools as well. Now, I will say don't get your hopes up too much. There is not high turnover in this area. Only one home has sold in here over the last year. That sales price, 1.9 million. There is a home that is pending. The list price, 2.6 million. We'll have to see where that one ends up closing out at. Another big plus for most homeowners, there's no HOA in here. And that is true for the neighboring community that also makes the list Shady Croft Acres. Shady Croft Acres has a similarly few number of homes to Mountain Range View. The home sizes in here are a little bit wider ranging in the 2,000, 2,500 square foot range, all the way up to 9,000 square feet. Most of the homes in Shady Croft Acres are on one to three acre lots, which is fantastic. And a lot of them back up to the High Line Canal with fast and easy access to that fantastic hiking, biking trail. The homes in Shady Croft Acres range from everywhere, from being built in the mid-century era to new construction. There may be homes that need to be pretty much a full gut job to gorgeous, stunning. Don't have to lift a finger and you can move right in. Four homes have sold in here over the last year with an average sales price of $1.75 million. But the price range is 1.2 to 2.1 million over here. Now let's move over to the southwest side of Littleton to Deer Creek Mesa. It is a whole different world over here. You're actually gonna see that I moved to a shaded spot. We have kicked right into summer gear from winter in pretty much a two day time frame. Deer Creek Mesa and the community we're gonna visit next back right up to Deer Creek Canyon Park. They have gorgeous views over here. Yeah. For Deer Creek Mesa, the lot sizes are really all over the map. Half the lots have two acre sizes or smaller. And for those lots that have larger sizes, they push up into seven, 10 acres, sometimes larger. The home sizes out here run from the modest 3,000 square feet to the very spacious 8,000 square foot range. And the views, as you can see from all this footage, are absolutely gorgeous. Three homes have sold out here in Deer Creek Mesa in the last year. The average sales price was two and a half million dollars, but to put a little perspective on that, one of those homes was five million and the other two homes were 1.3 million. Deer Creek Mesa has no HOA that oversees this community. And that means with all of this acreage, you have quite a bit of freedom to do with your land as you wish. Now, this next community we're gonna go see may be one of the most beautiful communities I have ever put on video and one of my favorites. Welcome to White Deer Valley and this gorgeous luxury acreage community. White Deer Valley has a handful of custom homes encapsulated by open space on all sides. This open space affords views of the hogback, the red rock formations, the valley area, and the meadows. On the east side of Deer Creek Valley are where most of the larger lots lie. Many of these are 10 acres in size or larger. 
Then when you push over to the west side of the community, that is where the cluster of some of the smaller lots are, sometimes just two or three acres large. These stunning custom homes run anywhere from 5,000 to 10,000 square feet. And while there is an HOA in this community, these homes are approved to play host to horses. Most homes in here were built in the late 90s to early 2000s, so they are still very up to date and absolutely gorgeous inside and out. Three homes have sold in the White Deer Valley area over this past year. Average sales price is running about $3.6 million. There is a home currently for sale in here on a massive amount of acreage, list price around $8 million. White Deer Valley and Deer Creek Mesa are neighboring communities. They both border this Deer Creek Canyon area. And now I know that having this kind of beauty and backing up to this kind of open space really is not in everyone's price point, but because of the variety and the style of homes, the variety of acreage, the price spread across these communities does open up this kind of space, this kind of beauty, access to these amenities to a wider pool of buyers at least. So if you've got questions about landing yourself some land close to town, you know I would be happy to chat with you, answer questions, talk about these areas or others. There are some other places to snag some space from neighbors and still be close to town. Please feel free to reach out however works for you and I will see y'all next week.